Hi Virgo, welcome to your reading. This is a general love reading. Let's continue. Let's uh, shuffle the deck four times. Let's start with the current situation. What are the current energies? Feeling still connected to them, energetically, emotionally, feeling lots of attraction and passion for that connection. Wanting to build that long-term happy commitment and waiting, waiting to see progress. And you overthink a lot about everything that happened in the past. But let's see what is affecting you in your subconscious right now. That lie, that dishonesty, somebody may have cheated as well, so take what resonates, but there was this energy of not being transparent, not straightforward. There may have been a case of lack of honesty in that uh, connection. And that is what is affecting you in your subconscious. Now, what happened in the past? Uh, what happened in the past? What was the challenge or the challenges? Somebody was keeping their options open and this led to confusion the situation felt stuck many times, like it was not progressing naturally, especially because of the conflicts, the mind, game, mind games, uh, the big egos. Uh, and that was a big problem, a big roadblock for the progress of the relationship. Now, how do you view it? How do you view the situation? You'd like a restart. You want to believe that there will be a restart, especially after the silence treatment or lack of communication. You see both of you being guarded, but you want that leap of faith again. You want to trust in that connection again. What you fear is that you will continue to be uh, very uh, closed off or they will continue to be very close off towards you. You don't like that lack of vulnerability or lack of being more open and having that conversation or being more honest with each other. You feel overthinking, stuck in your head, not finding a solution to what happened, to to what solution to give to the situation. You want progress, but you don't know how how that progress should come. Now, the easy way would be to just leave this uh, past situation behind, but you don't know, you don't want that. You want to believe and hope again in that connection. That's why you you have your logical mind may, te may be telling you that uh, it's not good to repeat it, but your heart is telling you to stay. And that's why there may be this inner conflict and this overthinking and you feeling stuck. You don't like that. You want more clarity. Now, let's see about their energies. They want another chance. That's what they hope for. They dream a lot about long-term happy commitment, hopefully for more stable, solid connection, but they lack that courage to approach you or they know that there's a lack of trust in that connection at this moment. Nine of Wands. They feel like there's lots of pain and hurt, especially after what happened in the past. And that makes the situation very fragile, very delicate and... Uh, even to start the communication, it seems like uh, it's a heavy uh, job. So they want to restart, they think a lot about it, even though they know there are many red flags there in the past, but they want to dream big. They lack that courage to approach you. They see you as feeling hurt as well, like you cannot trust them easily anymore. I will continue this reading in the extended with more details about what kind of feelings do they have towards you right now? How do they view you from the outside? What are their intentions? What about the energies? 
If you want to watch the extended, you can find it now in the description box below this video. Or if you are watching this from your mobile phone, you can just click the title, the description box will expand, and at the top you can find the extended link. Thank you for watching, see you in the next reading, and bye for now.